Hey, this is Miranda from My Scrappy Life and welcome back to my channel. This is another process video for Confessions of the Paper Attic Cut File Shop where I use this cut file right here which is called Florals Ant or Antler Florals or Floral Antlers. I'll get the link and everything down below. Now, I am working on the She's Magic collection and it is all about the boho themed right now for the month of February for Confessions of the Paper Attic Cut File Shop. Yesterday there was tons of them being released with tons of process videos and mine is going up today using one of the cut files. Now I did do my typical cut file where I cut it on patterned paper and then came back with white and backed it and then added some dimensionals all off camera just so that it cuts out a little bit of this. Because this part of it took me forever and a day. I wanted to add that bohemian style to it with some thread and some hippie vibes. So I got out this twine and added this because the pictures that I showed you is of my daughter in her first grade year. No, yeah, first grade. And she wanted to wear this dress for the first time and I absolutely love it. It's perfect on her. It was just a perfect fit for her perfect personality. And what I did was is that I took two photos of her. She wanted to do two different types and I kept both of them to put on this particular layout. And it was just a normal day at school for her. She just wanted her pictures taken that morning. So, And then of course I loved them and it worked perfectly for this, um, for this layout and with this cut file. Now the cut file is, I'm pulling it up right now to make sure that I state the right name of it. But like I said, it'll be linked down below as well for you to go and grab. Um, let me see here. Let me see what it is called. So she has a bundle. She has a February bundle that is available and it's got my antlers, the floral antlers. It's got some feathers. It's got a flower. It's got an arrow with a feather and a couple other ones. I'll link that one down below. And then she also has this one too. And I've got to find it because I know that it's called something or another. Let me see. Okay, let me see what she has this under. But anyway, while I find it, like I said, I'll link it down below. So here I am, I'm placing everything on this paper and I'm just doing my backing part of it. And I get it to where it's all done and pretty and all of that jazz. And I do distress and all that. And then you'll see me take some of this off because it didn't quite fit underneath this or under like tucked quite quite like I would like it to so I cut some of it off to make it fit right and it's still it looks really good I love the way it looks and it just fits not only my daughter daughter's personality but also mine so I hope that you're having a wonderful weekend and a wonderful time I cannot believe that January passed by but also at the same time it felt like January took forever and a day at school because it's 31 days and I swear the 31 days was just not going to go by. I'm like, this is crazy. But now we're on to February. Um, we are down to a little under 70 or we're a little over 70 days left to school, which is awesome because last week Monday or my last week Monday was the 100th day of school. So then we've just been counting down since to the very last day of school for the summer break. And I can't believe it. I mean, it's already been that long. You know, for us here in the States, if you are doing um, your taxes, we, you know, we've only got now three months left to go, three months and two weeks or 15 days, if you want to call it that. And we started our taxes because I had to wait to get my taxes. One of them because they only give it to you on the very last day of the month because, you know, that's how the county works. When you're doing the county and the federal, you just never know when you're going to get the stuff. So 
we got it done at the our county and so I was sitting down and doing it and I was like yeah I got a little while so so now I'm gonna be working on that yippee yippee so now here we go now now that I got everything down now it's all about embellishments so now I'm going through all of the embellishments and literally the rest of this is how I dress up these antlers And I make them all fancy. I just love all the little bits that I add. I add some dimension to the dimension of this because, you know, I've gotten so much other stuff on this. You know, like a, like the thread and these are chipboards. So the chipboards are a little bit thicker. So some of the dimension is like dimension on dimension with the antlers, you know, because I back those up. And I'm just tucking and I'm adding little things to these. And my title is magical. And I do leave my title there. I do actually like the fact that I literally kept streamed line all the way up. I was going to change it. And then I realized that there's tons of birds to this collection. So I'm adding the birds on the twine. The brown twine. It's um, actually hemp that I added to my antlers. And I'm just adding all these hearts. I'm just going through and adding tons and tons of different stuff. So make sure you go check out the group. There are amazing things. We are one month away from Virginia's one year anniversary of opening up her Etsy shop. And if you are not part of the group now, my suggestion would be part of the group. Because starting in February or starting in March, we're going to have tons of different challenges and all that kind of stuff going on because it is her one year anniversary and like I said here I am I'm adding all of the birds that I was talking about to her to this layout so here I am I'm gonna add, I'm gonna keep adding birds you'll see me add more birds because the puffy stickers has birds too but um She's going to have a bunch of stuff. We're going to have a bunch of challenges going on. I've already had some sneak peeks of the Valentine's Day collection that she's going to release this month. And I can't wait to see what that's all about. I can't wait for that. And then also at the same time, we are. I've also seen what she's kind of got for March going on. You're not want to going to, you don't want to miss it. So you want to make sure that you are added to the group and then get your notification on the Etsy shop. You just hit the love little heart button and make it your favorites. And then anytime that she uploads new cut files to the shop, it will give you a notification either through the app, if that's what you have, or through email to say, hey, she's uploaded some new stuff. So at least you know what we're all working with. And let's see here. So now I'm just adding a bunch of different little hearts. And I'm just going through it. I'm adding more flowers and hearts and all of that. And then I do round out with two different types of shimmers. Which is two different types. It's Goldilocks and then the heavy, the heavy metals. Those are the two that... Um, I use for my shimmers because I, you got to add a little shimmers to that, right? And yeah, so then I add that bird to act like it's going to fly onto the antlers. And I just love all the goodness to this. I hope that you enjoy this as much as I do. I truly love how this turned out. I love this collection from Dear Lizzie. It's one of my favorites. And I'm going to use it all up as much as I possibly can. But at the same time, I'm like, I don't want it to go away. Because this one was like one of my favorites. I really loved how this one turned out. She did an amazing job for this. And yes, yeah, so now I'm just adding all these little bits to it. I get it going and I just add. Now these are the little glitter um, hearts and flowers and little bits of like enamel dots. Those get added. I do add a puffy sticker here at the end. And then I do leave a little bit of 
this left in to show the shimmers that I add. Not only do I add um, gold Goldilocks, but then I do add the heavy metal, which is like silverish. Um, shivers gold color, so I think that it adds well to the um, holographic to a lot of these stickers that I did add. And then that's about it. So I'm going to leave you with a little bit of music and me finishing out these along with the splattering so you can see all the goodness. The still shots are coming up. Make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel along with getting a part of that group because you don't want to miss out any of the new cut file releases and all of the fun things that we do over at Confessions of the Paper Attic Cut File um, shop or in the group. And then make sure that you check out the shop. Make sure that you give it... Um, into your favorites so that you get those notifications there. And I hope that you have a wonderful day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.